That's why when Aisha radiallahu anha was accused, guess what Allah said in the Quran? Allah says, those who came with the accusation, they are from amongst you. They are in your midst, from your kith and kin. Don't think it's bad for you. It's actually good for you. What do you mean? They spread rumor about me. How can it be good for me? Your status is elevated and we're giving you an opportunity to see if you're going to forgive this person or not. You forgave them. Subhanallah, you arrived at a status beyond your imagination of contentment in this, in this dunya, in this world, of goodness in the deen, the acceptance to do good deeds. Allah gives you acceptance to do good deeds. You are not sitting here because you wanted to sit alone. You are sitting here because Allah accepted that want of yours to sit here. That's what it is. And above that, Allah Almighty says, you know what? We will forgive you. We will forgive you in the hereafter. Because Allah's quality of forgiveness, He is the most forgiving. When He sees you have a small quality of it, He'll forgive you as well. My brothers, my sisters, I wish to end by saying, let's not harm one another. Let's not oppress one another. No matter who it is, at home, at work, wherever else it may be, let's talk good about one another. We are an ummah. We are all members of the Ummah and this Ummah needs us. It needs every one of us, everyone seated here, everyone who might hear this later. The Ummah needs you, everyone. And to be a positive member of this Ummah, learn to have a big heart, learn to sacrifice, learn to let go of things that are not so important. It's okay. What are they going to do if they say this and do that? It's okay. And wherever the need arises to stand firm for a cause, we stand for it for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah bless all of us. May Allah soften our hearts. May Allah truly make us better people so that when we fulfill our salah, our hearts are content. When we say Allahu Akbar, we're not thinking of our enemies. We're rather thinking about Allah and how insignificant we are. I need the salah. I desperately need to put my head on the ground for Allah with a clear mind to say Subhana Rabbi Al-A'la. Not that I'm busy thinking about, let me spend my time cursing this one and hurting this one. Let's not do that. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us goodness. Aqulu qawli hadha wa sallallahu wa sallama wa baraka ala nabina Muhammad. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Deen John and Deen John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Deen John and Deen John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Deen John and Deen John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Deen John and Deen John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you.